So guys, let's be honest. A lot of people are going to be looking to get in shape now because you've been in an uncomfortable place. You put it on body fat, myself included. <laughs> Last month I put on body fat and I've had to adjust. I'm motivated now to make a change. So I've got a plan of action in order to lose body fat, in order to achieve the goal I want. But something I don't do and something I don't do with my clients and something you guys need to stop. Don't try to go from a position of zero to a position of 100. It's just not going to work. I see it all the time. You guys are really motivated to make a change, which is fantastic. But you try to do like everything at once. You're trying to do cardio. You're trying to do weights. You're trying to restrict yourself heavily on your food. You're trying to, you know, imagine you want to do hikes. And the first thing you say, you've never done a hike in your life. You say, listen, I'm going to go do Mount Everest. Of course, you're not going to say that. You're going to start with some small little hill in the berg. You know, you're not going to go for the craziest thing when you are so inexperienced. So why, 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 when you haven't done much exercise, or even if you're moderately experienced in exercise, why do you go from zero to 100? Why do you go from not doing much to suddenly massive differences? I myself, I've been training for a long time. I've been dieting. I've been doing all these things. When I want to get in shape, I make as little changes in my life as possible in order to get the maximum results. So when I want to make a change, guys, I'm experiencing this. I've been doing this for a long time. I've had a reasonable amount of success with it. I coach other people how to do it successfully. I just try to adjust the corners of my life. I try to cut off the loose ends and I'll get a result from that, of course. And then once that result plateaus, I then cut the corners a little bit more. But I don't go and take my life and immediately make it like this to try to get a result. I had small adjustments, guys, but a lot of you are, you know, you, you've sat on your ass for three months or, you know, you haven't really applied yourself for three months and then you want to do the craziest weight loss things. You want to completely change the way you eat. You want to completely change the way you exercise. And it's not realistic, guys. Your body and you as a person cannot handle extreme changes at a time. It needs to be small little incremental changes because the person who tries to do everything at once and wants to go 100 miles an hour is not going to last. The person who does small things every month, one year later, they're still doing the process, they're still involved in the journey because it was manageable and they're still in shape. The other person, they're back at square one because they went to 100, failed, went back to zero, sat for a few months, and now they want to go to 100 again. So guys, when it comes to losing weight, getting in shape, whatever your freaking goal is, small adjustments to your life to get a result, and then small adjustments again and again and again and again.